So what is the strategy adopted under UTI Midcap Fund for portfolio churn? Hello everyone. Thanks a lot for that question. So if I were to look at the investment philosophy of the UTI Midcap Fund, then the fund predominantly invests in good quality businesses around 60 to 70% of the portfolio in companies which are high quality companies that have a long runway. These companies which are run by good quality management. As these companies compound their earnings over a period of time, we see the benefit of that compounding in your investments over long duration of time. And therefore you need to hold on to these businesses for the long term to be able to see that benefit. Therefore, the churn in that part of the portfolio is kept at quite a low number. Because once you identify good company run by good quality management, then you want to hold on to those businesses over the long term. The fund also invests around 30 odd percent of the portfolio in what we call turnaround or transformational opportunities. These companies are typically decent businesses but are going through a cyclical downturn today. And therefore, if you identify these businesses well, and as you see a lot of weaker players in that sector moving out, these companies tend to benefit disproportionately when the in the cycle or the macro cycle reverts. And therefore, you get benefit of both earnings growth and mean reversion playing up. We also invest a smaller part of the portfolio in what we call transformational opportunities where there could be structural change which may be happening with the company or sector leading to a structural re-rating in the stock or sector. The churn in this part of the portfolio could be on the slightly higher side because as the investment hypothesis plays out or the cyclical upside plays out, you may want to book some of your investment gains. Overall although, we want to maintain this strategy with a slightly lower churn and have a lot more longer term orientation so that you could see the benefit of growth in these small and mid cap indices as they become the large caps of future. Thanks a lot everyone for your patience. Mutual fund investments are subject to market risks. Read all scheme-related documents carefully.